directions for each class. So as you are waiting for your work, okay, uh, let's see. Max, I'll have you up next assignment right now. And you can talk later, please. But you'll have your next assignment. All right. So pre algebra, we need to have out our notes. Last time we had a video lecture, and need to have us open to pages 106 and 107. We're doing problems 1 through 23 odd. All right, math six. I need everybody. Shh, need everybody looking and listening up here in math six. Math six. I'm waiting until I've got all eyes and ears turned up this way. Math 6, if you did not turn in your assignment, if you didn't finish it during class yesterday, please turn that into the basket right now. So we'll be collecting that right now. Please turn in your assignment to the basket. Remember that was multiplying decimals. Alright, math 7. What I need you guys to do, look to the back of the table there, that back desk. See how there are those blocks there? I need you to get 20 or 30 of them for each person. So 20 or 30 blocks per person, all in that 7. Between 20 and 30, it doesn't matter the exact amount. You just need a lot of blocks. Awesome. Alright, so 10. Yes. Uh, and I think you have those buttons in the best. I'm just going to put it away. Uh, they are going to be going through these things. Okay. They're going to be given a bunch of those parties. Okay. And these supplies that they need. Okay. And they need to find the items that they need and the items that they need and the items that they need and find out how much money they're going to do. They can choose things to stagger on the traditional parties. Thank you. Okay, so. So they just go around the different tables of the paper. Math 6, math 6, math 6. We need to make sure we've all got our. Each person. Yeah, what are we getting? Uh, each person. Uh, sorry, but my name is Gilbert Chan. Okay. Do they also have this sheet? Math 6. Listening and looking up here. Listening and looking up here. Today, we are going to be doing an activity that involves decimals. Adding, subtracting, multiplying. And I need us all of us listening. Uh, Sierra, where are you going? Sierra. I got it. I'll do it. Thank you, Mila Sensei. Directions to give, and I want you guys to have as much time as possible. So I need every everybody's eyes looking up to me in that six. Everybody's eyes looking up here. Bryson, awesome. All right. So you are going to be planning a party, and Tabby is going to be out in Nihon Kai. And she'll give you a note card that tells you your budget for the party, how much money you can spend, and the things that you need. All of those things have prices listed out in Nihon Kai. So you need to go around to the various tables, find the prices of the things you need, find out how much those are going to cost, and find out how much money you have left over. If you have money left over for your party, after you've figured out how much money you have, 
you can look and spend it on extra things for your party. Now, making sure we know this is a fictional party Aww. with fictional money and fictional Dang supplies. It. Dang it. So, you're going to be preparing that. And if you get done early and Tabby checks your work, you can make a problem for someone else. You can make a note card that has the supplies they need and their money. And if you make one, show your answer key and turn that into me. Each note card you make with the correct key will be worth an arigato. So you've got a chance to earn some arigatos for your advisory. So, math six, please stand up and head up to me and Honkai with Tabby. Take your pencils with you, take your sheets with you. Okay. Uh, that means I can't train. So, that's what I'm going to turn. Uh, so, yeah, let's give you guys some tips for the left here. Okay, we're not going to be doing lightsabers here. So, uh, yeah, yeah, move yourselves to the tables. Uh, put the mat six things just to the edge of the desks. So we're not going to push them off the desk, we're going to be very respectful of other people's things. But we're going to put them at the edges of our desks. And... Okay, uh... Sam, do you want to work by yourself then, or do you want to work in a group of three? So, I'm going to start in pre algebra on these problems. And Math 7, you're probably wondering what we are doing with these blocks. So, we are we're going to be building various shapes. And we're actually going to be using our textbooks today um, and doing an activity exploring surface area and volume. So I need you to turn. Okay. Uh, so we're going to turn to page seventy-eight. Wait. Oh. Uh, just seventy-eight. Okay. And okay. I need blocks. On the desk, when we get the directions, we need to turn to page 78. And, speak and share with Ayla. And we're going to work in partners for this one. So we're working in partners. And your table partners will be just fine for that. And you guys are going to, on a piece of notebook paper, answer the questions there. So it's going to give you some directions about building block shapes. And it's going to ask you some questions about those. So, going to be making those block shapes and answering questions about those. So, go ahead and get started there. I'm going to be circulating around the room, making sure everybody is getting done what they need to get done. Make sure everybody's.